Many, many countries all over the world depend extremely heavily on agriculture as part of their livelihood. And agriculture has a tremendous impact on those livelihoods and on, on the environment. The main aim of this project is to address the problems in the agricultural sector in Ethiopia through helping agricultural colleges to develop stronger education that they're delivering to agricultural graduates. Ethiopia's economy has been growing at 10% a year for the last 10 years and now is the fastest growing economy in all of Africa. So Ethiopia is doing everything it can to alleviate its poverty and agricultural problems, but there are still quite a few challenges that it faces. You go to the rural areas or the agricultural areas and you could tell you know, how it affected the environment, erosion, you could see very, very obvious because they are not using technologies that will protect the environment, technologies that will protect the soil, technologies that would sustain the soil fertility, technologies that will improve production, technologies that will improve their food security. And Ethiopia has problems with repeat famines, um, which causes food assistance, maybe up to four million people needing food assistance at a certain time. Also problems with deforestation and climate change. The Dalhousie involvement in this project has really involved almost 10% of staff on the agricultural campus. The Ethiopian agricultural colleges have a huge amount of experienced staff, um, so we are really here to facilitate their growth. In, in the past, technologies have been transferred from developed countries to developing countries, and these technologies has largely failed. It failed because indigenous were not participating in the decision making. You may think they need roads to transport food from, from the rural areas to the cities, but that's not the case. You may think they need potable water, but that's not the case. Probably they need fertilizer, probably they need seeds, probably they need the skills to you know, do their agricultural practices to have higher production. So it's always good that you know, we involve them over 500 staff on the agricultural campuses um, in Ethiopia have benefited from training from Dalhousie. When we first started the project, some of the campuses only had six computers that weren't working, very few demonstration sites, and through the impact of the project, they now all have fully functioning IT laboratories. They have all their infrastructure, books are being transferred to them, they have internet, they can browse online, they can do research, they have instrument equipment going to Ethiopia now, you know, it has been approved, it's being shipped there, everyone is happy, it's working, their library is working. The legacy of this project will be some excellent curriculum and the idea is that these four colleges in Ethiopia will be used as a model which the government can then expand to all of the 16 agricultural colleges in Ethiopia. So we're hoping this will have a legacy throughout Ethiopia. Currently we have a similar agricultural projects in Uganda. So we're really looking for synergies between the curriculum developed in our different programs and to really try and make a difference across East Africa. I think it falls upon universities to really get out there and to try to make that sort of impact uh, globally. It's amazing, you know, they've taken it up strongly, they've seen the sense of belongingness, they've, you know, and they are working with it, and it's, it's working. 